creating this video to warn people of a very serious virus circulating the internet right now. Um, it's probably the most serious and complex virus to ever hit Internet Explorer. Uh, I call it serious because most viruses, the surfer will know, the user will know he has a virus, I'll have annoying pop-ups all over the place. In this case, there's no pop-ups. It just sits there, waits for you to go to sensitive uh, sites like PayPal, eBay, and just grabs your information without you really realizing it. Um, System Restore hijacked this by about searching to Troy, Troy Attaweer, changing different network connections, running spyware software in safe mode, and nothing. none of that helps. So right now I'm in discussion with Level 2 at Microsoft support. They're trying to find a solution for this. They're dumbfounded and uh, maybe someone will come up with a solution before them. It's been three days now, mid-October 2008. As you can see, I have a HTTP debugging tool here that shows me the exact URLs that uh, websites go to when you go to certain URLs. If I go to eBay, for example, uh, the HTTP debugger loads all the eBay URLs. Then when you go to my eBay, and sign in you'll still see the eBay URL on top but notice how there's a new URL in the debugger called SIMIPIK and that's sitting in this computer and it was downloaded in some sort of way without anyone downloading any certain files by simply visiting a site it executed some code that's what makes it so dangerous now once you log in it would send them your information same goes with Bank of America. At some sites, they ask you to enter more personal information, um, such as your ATM code, which is obviously a fraud. Again, S-I-M-I-P-I-K loaded in the background. The URL on top is still Bank of America. This page, Properties, is still Bank of America. Same goes with PayPal. Once again, it tries to load SIMIPIK. What makes it even more dangerous is, even if SIMIPIK gets shut down, which I've been successful in the past few days shutting down some of their IPs, they can go ahead and remotely change how many computers are affected, possibly millions of computers, and go ahead and change the IP, and it's a problem. Right now, the key is to find a patch where people can download and fix this uh, error in Internet Explorer so um, they won't have to find out when they check their next credit card statement or their credit report that someone has robbed them uh, thousands of dollars or millions of dollars or whatever whoever they are because they get access to all types of bank accounts even if you don't use eBay PayPal or Bank of America any site with transactions this software is designed to capture please contact me if you know any solution but please serious technicians have already worked on this this is not an issue about sending some lock files to you and you check hijack this. this is far beyond that so please don't waste my time let's try to find a solution ASAP as this is a real serious virus